And welcome to the news at four. We begin with new at four sentencing day for the man who plowed his Porsche into a crowd at a Boise car show last year. You might remember this video here. Today we were inside the courtroom as victims relived that day. KTVB Shira Matsuzawa is in the newsroom to tell us what was said. Shira. Roy Drennan hit 14 people as he was leaving that car show. Today, a judge sentenced the 49-year-old to seven days in jail and two years of probation. No cameras were allowed in court, but this is video from when it all happened in September of 2017. Last month, a jury convicted Drennan of reckless driving. Police say he was leaving the car show when he accelerated, lost control of the Porsche, and then careened into the crowd. In court today, one of the 14 people hurt spoke out about that day. Canyon Derrick says, uh, that day comes back to him in waking flashbacks and that he, quote, gets scared and freezes in place and is taken back to that day. Others hurt that day also wrote letters to the judge and they too were read aloud in court. Parents of the youngest victim, Giovanni Aguilar, said the wreck robbed their son of his joy to play soccer and to play outside. The car fractured both the nine-year-old's knees, damaging important growth plates and sending him flying and cracking his head on the sidewalk. He spent months in the hospital. Drennan also spoke out in court today, apologizing and calling this the biggest mistake of his life. He also said he wished there was something he could do to make amends. And those hit uh, ranged in ages from 9 to 46. We all remember that day so yeah. well, I think. It was just such a shocking situation. And I wondered, you know, about those stories mm -hmm. that, that what people were suffering in the wake of it. It must have really been... Wow, just heavy to hear all of that in one sitting. And 14 people hurt. I know that's a big number, but I remember watching that video the mm. day it happened and thinking it could have been so much could, worse. Yeah, it could have been. So. All right, Shira, thank you for yep. the latest on that.